folks. We're going to test a couple of new uh, uh, binding agents today and see if they uh, are any better or worse than what we've been using, the PVA. So uh, what I've got on this one here is this uh, wallpaper paste, which is uh, methyl cellulose and uh, titanium dioxide on this side. And on this side, I've buffed the uh, graphite uh, into the surface there. And this one here, I have the new clear uh, PVA. It's not white glue anymore. It's clear glue. It's basically the same stuff, I think, except maybe they took out the, either the polyvinyl acetate or the uh, polyvinyl alcohol. And just you're getting one or the other, I think. So anyway, we're going to try uh, try both of those, and I've got uh, a piece of uh, flannel cloth that I've loaded with uh, graphite and uh, activated uh, carbon and, uh, and water on there. So we're just going to fire it up now and uh, see what we got. I'll start with this one here first and dip it down in the water here. Get it wet. I've got two meters going today, one for volts and and amps. Alrighty. Get the cord's out of the way so you can see. And I'll hook this one up. To there, and we have 118 volts. It looks like we're going to need a little paperweight or something here. All right. But, uh, all right. So our amps are on this one here, we, and we've got three, two, one, 46 for the start of that. Alright. Oh, there it is. Roll the tape. A little bit of weight on that. Alright, so we're at 109. 9, 110. Let's just hit it again right there and see what we got. Ready? There's the amps. 3, 2, 1. 64. Alright. It's going up. I'll be back. Well, no. Hell, we're back to 113 already. How did that happen? We were at 110 last time. I wasn't even watching this. Things just recharged so fast. Alright, so let's, let's hit it again there at 113.5. And we got 3, 2, 1, 73. Wow, look at that. And it's, each time it's climbing up higher than it did before, and it's like uh, in 10 seconds. Now we're at 115.2, and let's hit it again. 3, 2, 1, 80, 82. That time we're keeping climbing, and look, it's been 10 seconds, and we're at 114, 115. Uh, it looks like it's not going to climb much more than that. I mean, not real fast, anyway. Boy, that's some fast uh, self-charge, isn't it? I like that. I'll have to find out what's the in that PVA, whether it's uh, polyvinyl alcohol or polyvinyl acetate. All right, it did go up. We're at 116.3 now. Let's hit it again. Ready? 3, 2, 1. 92. We keep going up, and the voltage keeps going up at the same time. That's excellent right there. That's exactly what you want. Okay, man, look at that. Now, that, is that a is that a, a fast self-charge or what? I mean, it'll peak eventually somewhere, though. Now, this time, see, it's taking a little longer to get up there. But how much you want to bet that the amps go up again on that? 
we're headed just here at 116 rather than wait to get to 116.2 or 3 or whatever it was. Ready? Here we go. 3, 2, 1. 96. They did go up again. Alright. Clear glue works good. Alright, I'll be back. Alrighty. I gave it a, another couple minutes and it went all the way up to 117.4 there. So we're going to hit it right there and see what we got. Ready? 117.56. Ready? 3, 2, 1. 126. Woohoo! This baby is every time it's jumped and the voltage is getting is real nice. Alrighty, I'll be back. Alright, I'm back. And the cell's at 117.1. And we're going to hit that again real quick. Ready? 3, 2, 1. 140. Yep, still going up. Alright, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to disconnect this cell and we're going to build another one just like it except with the uh, wallpaper paste on it. Alright, so I've got the, this ready. I've got a piece of flannel there and I just gobbed it, gobbed it up with uh, some uh, graphite and carbon and stuff and we're going to dip our paper now get it wet and lay it on there like that electrode well you can just barely see that can't you up just a dab here. Alright, now let's hook this one up and see what we got. This one's at uh, 125.8. That's a nice voltage. That's higher than the other one. Alright. Let's see what kind of amps we got. Ready? 3, 2, 1. 63, I think it started. And the other one started at 58 or something, I think. How about we test it right there? 118.8. Ready? Three, two, one, sixty-four again. So that one didn't increase on the second time. Not like the TVA one did. So maybe the wallpaper paste bleeds through. That's possible. We'll see what happens. hit it one more time it's not gaining back up to the to its uh, other same voltage like the other one did either is it so uh, this is not performing as well I can tell that already all right let's see the amps are three two one 65 just a little bit better all right <coughs> I'll be back all right I'm back and I was going to plug up this little motor right here and run it, but it's uh, damaged. It's uh, drawing 120 milliamps, so it's too much. But I've got it hooked up here so that I can run these four little LEDs, and it's drawing six, six milliamps, and it drains the battery down slowly. And although it's holding right there <laughs> pretty good, 192. And... Uh, you can see it climbs right back up pretty quick. It'll be, it'll be back to 215 here.
shortly. Alright, that's 215. Let's do it again. I wanted to just give you some kind of a little load test on there. We're holding that 1.9 volts there. At some point, it'll 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 stabilize, and when the consumption uh, matches the uh, production, and it'll it should it'll stabilize. And I think that's it right there. I don't see the amps are are stable at 3.6, and the volts are stable at 1.9. Look at there. There, well, the answer just went down to flicking back and forth between the two. Alrighty, now we'll take it off and let it climb back. It's already over two. I've got these, I've put both cells in uh, series, obviously, so I could get over two volts out of it. That was a pretty, pretty long uh, draw right there. A minute or so, and they were at uh, almost back to 215. there we'll just do it again that's the most convincing proof really is uh, to show somebody there 215 uh, we'll back on it again all four LEDs lit up nice bright if it was nighttime you'd be able to see that better but they are lit up let's see if I can lift that up a little bit so you can see it better without the Disconnect and everything. I uh, see that. And so we're and we're back down to 1.9 volts again, and uh, this time we're 3.7, 3.6. That's 3.6 is where it was stabilized last time about. Between three five and three six. So yeah, I, th I don't know how long we could run this thing like this, but I'm betting it would run for a really long time. And then when it did run out, if it did, you just just uh, let loose of it and it recharge itself. Graphite felt. It's hard to get the uh, activated charcoal into that unless you really fine because that's a tight weave on that and uh, so far this uh, that little that flannel uh, the, the flannel cloth it, it works pretty good it holds quite a bit but I've got something else here if I've got time on this video I'll do it too but here's another little see that right how thick that is that's like a quarter inch and this is kind of a real loose uh, uh, more like a, a, a loose sponge and it holds a whole lot right there alright so we're almost back to uh, our 2.15 again and as soon as we hit that I'll hit it again alright there we are 2.15 volts and there's our lights again believe that's taken up all my time for this video right here so I thank you for watching folks and I'll see you next time